All right, so what's going on? We just got connected with App Raider. Um, now, he brought Flygon, Heatran, Venusaur, Grimmsnarl, Blastoise, and Torkoal. Now, I don't think I actually have any way to get off screens. I That being like, what? Defog or Court Change. Um, do I have U-Turn on Cinderace? Well, what am I, what am I clicking right now? I don't think I do, though. I mean, I might. Okay, so I do have U-Turn on Cinderace. So I want to lead it, and then I could honestly just click high jump kick. The only thing is if he leads with his um, Flygon, I would have to switch into Corviknight. But um, Cinderace high jump kick should be, like, mad free. So let's see what happens. I mean, and if he leads Grimmsnarl, that's going to be a problem, too. I need to go with I should have probably led with Galventula and set up the webs, but I, I don't know. I kind of like blinked on the lead. Um, he's going to lead off with P train, so I'm going to just straight up go for a uh, high jump hook. Um, ain't nothing he should really be able to do. Unless I miss, that would be unfortunate, but this should kill. Okay, so he scarfed e train. I did not expect that. And we actually still live on 21, though. Um, let's see if we miss. Oh, we do miss. Okay, so Cinderace, Cinderace decided that we were going to get a, get a lead in this battle. So I know he scarfed into, um, what is it, Earth Power. Um, I could honestly go Corporate Knight and U-Turn on whoever he brings in, so let's do that. Very nice, Cinderace. Very nice, very nice. So he's just gonna withdraw. Probably going to Torkoal. Um, set up the Drought, which is gonna be the Sun. How do I even deal with this now? Like, Cinderace was really the way I was going to try to win this game. And kind of trolled it. I'm not going to lie. No, I, Cinderace didn't kind of troll it. Cinderace did troll it. Um, I think I'm going to just go into Type No, set up some Swords Dances, maybe a Flame Charger too. Um, hopefully he doesn't have, like, Toxic. That would suck. Let's Swords Dance here. Oh, my mic was mad far from my mouth. I didn't even notice. So he sets up Stealth Rocks. Um, I don't know. I'm going to get greedy. I'm going to set up another one. Source Dance again. Let's see what he goes for here. He is going to go for a Flamethrower. He might try to get a Burn. Let's see how much damage that does. Oh, that's not doing too much. Only 40. We can go for a flame charge. So that we're faster than most things. That does some good chip. Raising our speed. And then I think I'm going to be... I'm going to go for a... Uh, let's see how much damage this is doing. So it's getting some more chip. With two crush claws, we should be able to kill. Let's go for a crush claw now. He's going to stay in. Wait. I could miss Crush Claw too? Oh. Wow. Oh, man. that that's This is tough. This is actually really tough, man. Holy, bro. Oh man, that that actually is just mad tough, bro. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. Cuz I'm I'm fairly certain we would have lived another turn. Um he's going to withdraw out of Torkoal. I'm going to Grim Snarl. Let's see how well Grim Snarl takes his Crush Claw. Oh, dang. It's going to bring it to 1. 
I'm actually just gonna go for a flame charge here to try to get even faster. I mean, wait, does he have sucker punch? Oh, he's gonna let it die to the flame charge. That's gonna put us at plus two. Now, I'm actually no speed on this guy. So, I don't know how much plus two is gonna put me at. Sunlight is gonna fade, so that reveals that Torkoal is, um... What is it? Not the Heat Rock set. He's gonna send back in Torkoal. Um... And I think I just go for the kill here. Um... This guy probably dies. I could go into Hitmonchan on the Venusaur because that's what he would do, right? He'd probably go Venusaur after um, to have max turns of sun. And then I could probably go something like Hitmonchan and Fire Punch it twice. So let's do that. We'll just kill it here. Wait, actually, should I have Flame Charge? I'm not sure how much flame charge is doing in the sun at plus four to be honest let's try it i mean i also get to stall a bit of sun turns this is kill oh that's not gonna kill so it's okay i mean i expected type null to die anyways i mean does it live does he get a low roll oh we live okay so that's even better because we could go for another flame charge now, I gotta say, I got this set from Arts. Arts did put me onto this set. I was like, yo, it was looking good. I'm trying to run it. He sent me the Poke Pace. I was like, I bet. I'm pulling up with the Flame Charge type no. And I think I'm at like plus four on the speed. Now, Venusaur, I'm not. Oh, he goes in the Flygon. This thing is probably first impression. Um, I'm actually gonna switch out of type no because. I want to get some chip on this thing. Is that a good play? I think so. Yeah, we could just go Corviknight on, on Flygon all the time. Like what? Because he could have first impression. Um, Corviknight is a hard answer to this thing anyways. See, we're going to take the rocks. He's going to crunch. Mirror armor. So he gets the defense drop. And I think... I want to, nah, I was thinking of uh, Dynamaxing here, but that's probably not the move. Oh, dang, I could have actually killed the Flygon. I'm surprised he, he switched it in like that. Um, let's go for a Brave Bird, I guess. Or do I U-turn? Let's U-turn. Oh, he's Dragon Dance Flygon. Huh. That's gonna make him faster than um my theorem actually. But I think I could go. Dang, maybe I should have just went for the crush claw then. I'm surprised he did that. Um I wish I had mock punch on this thing. Those rocks are actually really good for him because I can't really do nothing. I guess what? Sack type no, go Corviknight again, and then just Brave Bird? Yeah. Let's sack type no and go um, Corviknight. And then just Brave Bird. Corviknight is unfortunately going to take more chip, but um, we should do quite a bit of damage, especially if he hits us. Let's go for... I mean, I could also just Roost, right? Let's Brave Bird, whatever. Crunch. It's gonna do some great damage. He crit us. See, my thing is, right? My thing is, right? If I wasn't Mirror Armor, do you know he got two defense drops just now and he crit me? That's not wild. That's, that's not wild that he got two defense drops just now, and he crit me, and I missed turn one? That's not crazy? Yo, that's... Yo, what is going on right now? 
This is probably Shell Smash Blastoise. Um, I mean, I do have my guy in the back. What do I even need this thing for? Who does he have? He has Heatran. That gets 1v1 by, I think, Hitmonchan. Galvantula probably does nothing with the rocks up. Um, I guess I could just... Dynamax and G-Max win rage. Oh, this is what I should have done before. I forgot I had a a, a defog. I could have gotten the rocks away anyways. I forgot about that. Because I would have done that to the freaking Flygon. Oh my god. I would have I would have G-Maxed and like gotten away the rocks and like killed the Flygon if I had I just G-Maxed that turn. I forgot that I, I have that as an option. What does he go for? Does he smash? He's gonna smash. So that's actually fine now because, like I said, I have, um, who is it? I have Galvantula in the back with the Sash. Um, what is it? White Herb. So that doesn't really matter. Galvantula should be able to kill. Uh, I'm actually running Thunderbolt and not, um, Thunder. So that'll be okay. So we're going to get the rocks off. I could just Magic Guard. Let me see how much, how many turns does it? Uh, it's actually two turns of sun. I said magic guard. Let's just max guard here. Um, cause what is he gonna do? It, I don't think it really matters. He weather ball. Okay, so he has that tech. Weather ball tech. And I might just go for a max flutter by. Weather ball again. And Corviknight's gonna die. Like I said, Hitmonchan should be able to 1v1 um, Venusaur. So this isn't like the worst. We just go Galvantula here. Um, Volt Switch should just kill the percent that it's at. Now I would just Volt Switch. After seeing how much that uh that Rim Wage Wind Rage did. Earthquake is going to bring me down to my Sash. And he crit me again. Yo. he Who turned on the hacks, bro? Who did it? Who turned on the hacks? Turn them off. Turn them off, bro. What's what's going on? Like, <laughs> like he literally crit me mad times, bro. Like, what is going on? Turn one. They was on some nonsense, bro. Turn one. Turn one, bro. This is crazy. Crazy, like that's not crazy, yo, yo, what? From turn one though, that's how we moving. From turn freaking one, he's gotta go. Uh, let's see, he goes Venusaur, probably the G Max. I think Hitmonchan has a lot of speed on it. I'm gonna just go for a Fire Punch. Oh, hold on. Let me run a calc. Let me see, Hitmonchan versus the Ven, right? Outside of Sun. Let me paste the set. I just want to know, is it worth going for a Rapid Spin? That's all I'm trying to check right now. Hitmonchan versus Venusaur Sun Sweeper, right? Ven, Venusaur, Scorpio Sweeper. Let's just see when he Dynamaxes, right? If he's Modest Life Orb. That is going to be doing a lot. Fire Punch only does 30 to 36. So it's a 3 hit KO. And I actually get 2 hit KO'd by this thing. So I think I want to sack Galvantula. And then bring it back in. Right? Yeah. Oh, he did a Dynamax. Because it would show off the first turn. What does he click? Oh, he just sludge bombs. Huh, that's weird. Alright, I'm pretty sure Hitmonchan can 1v1 um Heatran. So let's go cure him. Gonna apply the pressure. And uh, I'ma just go for the freeze drive. He doesn't Gigantamax his Venusaur. 
Sludge Bomb again. That does nothing. Oh, that that's actually not nothing. Just Freeze Dry again. I'm mad confused. Maybe he felt bad because of the hacks. That's like literally the only thing I could think. Because he's playing weirder than me. I ain't even going to front. I thought he was just going to Gigantamax. And then I would be able to stall it out to then go cure him. But, I mean, he kind of just lost not Gigantamax in there. I wonder why he didn't. Um, he's going to, what, lock himself into the fire move? Eruption. That's actually going to do mad damage. Um, to hit my Chan in the back. Alright. Him on Chan versus Heatran. Um, offensive. That thing is Scarf. I'm gonna just. Whoa, can Earthquake kill this thing? Hold on. Because I was gonna Drain Punch. But if Earthquake kills it, then we should be good. Yeah, Earthquake should just kill. He's gonna erupt. We are AV. Max Special Defense. Careful. So we're gonna eat that right up. Um, no burn. And this should kill. So yeah, that's gonna be a GG2 apparator. Um Bro, I don't know. The I should have swung on the type no, but after getting like hacked so many times, I was just like not in the right mindset. Like what is going on, bro? Anyways, apparator's channel is gonna be on the screen. Leave a like if you guys enjoyed. Right now I got a battle against Bruno YCL. That's gonna actually be a tough one. So I hope you guys watch those battles and see what happens. See you guys in the next one. Peace.